fellow passengers and Fargan ice holes. My name is Alex Tyler, or welcome back to Destiny Warmind. Here we are, back at it, back at it again, ready to get back to the action, the the mayhem, and the rumble of everything. Here we go, back into everything we need to do. So, yeah, the last mission was pretty good. We fought the Taken. It was all right. I mean, nothing special happened about it. Just blowing things heads off with guns and slaughtering them mercilessly without mercy and everything. Felt good. Felt nice. Good stress reliever. You know, good things like that. <laughs> but um, anyway, yeah, we're going to get back into it now. Hopefully nothing stupid will happen out of it, so hey. But um, one thing that I find interesting about this whole thing is that, like, just to manic this dynamic of weaponry and how they view Rasputin as this weapon and yet at the same time Anna Bray knows it isn't a weapon so but she asks him to destroy things for her so she still uses him like a weapon even though Rasputin isn't a weapon he's an AI who controls a weapon thing that is his body it's like putting it's like putting a brain inside a gun and the and you pull the trigger but you have to ask the gun to shoot for you when you pull the trigger. It's weird like that. So but anyway, let's get back into it. We're gonna head over to there and uh I'll let you guys know when I get over there. Actually, never mind. <laughs> We're right here. So uh yep, let's get going. But anyway, back on topic about what I was saying, like Imagine how this is going to be when they actually combine all his pieces together and make Rasputin whole again. What exactly will that happen? And of course it will make us more ready for any other problem that come our way. For whatever other expansion that is. Like for whatever other enemies we come in to face in the future and everything. But we don't know what that might be. Anyway, we're going to be fighting this and hopefully nothing bad will come out of it. I don't know what it will be, I don't know what, what what this game holds in the future, but we're going to see what happens. If we find the place where this godworm feeds, we can use the Traveler's Fragment to draw out Zol. Okay, here we go. Nothing stupid probably going to happen here, so nothing well, at all. I studied the logs. Rasputin was barely able to stop Zol the first time. Our mission stands. We will defeat Zol. My question is, is like, how did he get behind the door when we opened it? Guardians, I'm getting some kind of interference. I can't make sense of it. I hear it too. Give me a minute to analyze the signal. Maybe I can figure out what it is. Oh yeah, this thing is nice. This thing is smooth. Yeah, you take him down. You take him out real nice. Good, 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 good. Nice, nice, nice. Man, you treat this thing how it's supposed to be treated, it, it will take care of you nicely. Just like, mmm, nice. The interference I'm is saying nice worse, too much. I'm starting to pick up a pattern. <laughs> Do you hear it, Anna? I'll need more data to be sure, but yeah, I'm thinking it might be an encoded message. Hmm, you think? Or, or do you know? That's the main question you want to ask. Oh well, hey. Eh, shut up, you stupid thrall thingy. Hmm. Wait, what? That. Okay. Sure. Those crystals are surging with energy. They must be using them to gather power to feed Zol. Interesting. Okay. Kill you. Kill you. Oh, come on, die already. There we go. The energy in this relic is volatile. Try throwing it at the crystal. Already did it, buddy. Already did it. 
So, yeah. It looks like the hive have been busy down here. Keep going. According to scans, there's a large chamber where all the tunnels intersect. That makes it the most likely spot for Zol's feeding ground. We can probably tell from this DLC that it's not really meant to be action-packed, even though it is. It's not meant to be big, giant, big action thingy. It's meant to hold lore and add to the story of Destiny, which I like. It gives Look at those the size of people. these tunnels. Zol must be immense. Meaning Zol is stronger than we thought. All the more reason to take it down now. I wonder if there's any of those things over here. But anyway, um, one thing that I find interesting is that like this this DLC is meant to add to the story of Destiny. Like, not just of course it's, of course it's supposed to do that, but its its main objective is to be like basically you know just kind of like adding to the story like it's a story based DLC what I'm trying to say okay just <laughs> whatever <laughs> what I'm what I'm trying to say is that it, this will give those people who do like you know like my name is Bife like a, 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 something a, a long time to do and everything it'll give them something to do while we wait for more content to come out for this game that's what I like about the most about this here it's meant just to be kind of like just come here and enjoy yourself, but also enjoy this good story we made. It's tying up loose ends too, which I like a lot too. It's making sure that we know what's happening in the end and how what happened to certain characters and what's going on and everything like that, which I liked a lot too, which is really, really, really nice. Don't you dare do that to me. Come here, you. Yep. Come here. Ooh, boy. Guess what you're getting? Big face of golden gun. And booby. <laughs> you're dead. You're dead. You are also dead. Let me give it let me give some to you too. Hey, look what you got, look what I can give you. Oh wow. This is perfect for them. Jeez. I am so glad I, I use this for this mission. It makes it they so were much easier. In an archaic form about a priest, Nocris, and how he was labeled a heretic. What could possibly qualify as heretical for the hive? Something about resurrection. Yeah, if you want me, if you want me to give you a short version of what why that's heretical, basically Hive is all about dying, the will of the sword. I forget, I think it's called. But basically, what that means is that like this guy is a necromancer. He tries to bring back the dead to serve him, and that's bad for the Hive because they see that death is the only way to for further their species. The weak, this the strong kind of survive, space. and the weak They're die. another offering for Zol. Hmm. So, yeah. And this guy went against the grain, against his father, uh, um, Oryx and everything. So, that's why he's seen as heretical. Hmm. I'm trying to pick these things off from a distance before they come rushing at me. And, oh boy, you're a big guy. I need to find these things and kill them quick. one. Alright, where's the next one at? I should have I should used my dagger there. That's a waste of a grenade. They got these snipers in the back. That should help me out a little bit. What's close to me right here? Something's close to me. Ah, there you are. Right, where is this thing at? There you go. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. 
No, 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 no. Come on. I don't want to die. 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 Okay, there we go. I gotta pop my super here. Wow, you went down faster than I thought. I thought it was going to take a lot more damage. Oh, well, hey. Because my, my super was barely, my uh, heavy weapon was barely doing any damage to him, like, I guess because it's not that strong, but still, come the on. Round is right below us. I've decoded the interference pattern. Aka, Ayer, Yule, Ur. Those are names, Guardian. Ancient, yes. powerful names. Yes, they are. Anna! Anna! Hmm. Oh well, hey. Interesting. Take care of you. Stop healing, you stupid jerk. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. There you go. Nice. And here comes That's the king. Old. Yep. Come here, big guy. Come here. Yeah. Nice. Ooh, okay. This guy's a little tough. Uh, eventually he's going to get to the part that I really don't like, which is the throwing balls at sticks and hopefully nothing bad happens out of it. There he goes. Get, let's get this nice and ready for him. Yep. Yeah. Now where's the knight going to show up? Here he comes. Where's he at? Huckleberry out. Ready to fight. Oh, nice. That is a smooth man. Oof. Ah, there you are. Oh, you stupid jerk. Take you out. And... Yeah. This guy isn't that tough. Yeah, there you go. Nice. Save the super for when I either either if I get in danger, or or like for like to finish him off. Probably just to finish him off because this guy is annoying to deal with. It's just kind of tedious to fight him sometimes because all he does is like shoot at you with his big glowy hand, or does something worse like this. Oh come on, you stupid jerk. Mm, whatever. Hmm. Nope, 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 need to run, need to run, need to run. Maybe to do some single target damage too. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Oh, snipers on my butt. I need to take these guys out. Nice. Okay, okay, where are these? Hmm. I don't like this position. I need to get back here. Good. I like that better. Okay, 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 okay. I really hate these snipers. They're just so annoying sometimes. It's like, come on, man. Just, I get it. You got a big gun for a hand. We get it. We get it. You're you're very special to this big giant boss creature. We get it. Now stop shooting me for once and let me kill you. Mm. Like you. Stop putting up your freaking shield. There you go. 
Now, is he low enough for me to... No, he's at half health. I gotta get him down more. There we go. That works. Okay. Nice. I love how this thing is a good range too for for this kind of thing. Pretty good range for a uh, submachine gun. <clears throat> mm. Nasty, nasty. Is he low enough for my uh, thing to do more damage to him? Is he? No, he isn't. I want to get him low enough for that, for uh, my thing to do more, for my my uh, thing to do more damage to him. So if when that happens, I'm able to pop my super and then just blow him away. Yep. Eh, you stupid. Come on. Jesus Christ, I need to get out of here. I need, to get, I need to change positions. All right. Ah, crap. I could have... Mm. Oh, I'm an idiot. I am an idiot. I am. I am horribly sorry for that. Oh. Take care of you. All right, where'd that? Did I kill him? I forget. I didn't see him die. Maybe I did. I'm not sure. But with this, I'll definitely kill this guy. I need to get him down. There we go. Nice. Hide for a little bit. Get my health back up. Where's that sniper at? Okay, this, all this mission is a bunch of running around. Nope. Nope. Nice. Okay. Hit you with a knife in the head. You deserve that, you stupid jerk. Yeah, this is it, boy. You're gonna die. Come on, come on. Let's brawl a little bit. Let's brawl. And I can't brawl because you're a stupid jerk. Come on. There we go. Get him down. Ugh. All I do is run around and hope I don't die. Jesus. The they, question is, did I really sir. kill him? That's, where we can That's what I want to know. I really don't think I did, because if you, if you know anything about the hive and everything, you need to kill them in their special world, quote-unquote, in order to kill them. And I don't think I really did see... I don't really... I really don't think we've seen the last of Nocris. <laughs>
to know. <laughs> Guardian? Guardian, where are you? Well, my controller won't stop vibrating, so that's a good sign, right? <laughs> Excuse me. Zola is heading directly for the Clovis Break facility and Rasputin. If Rasputin dies, the Javelin goes with him. Zol wins. Very well. And my reservations about the war mind aren't as important as defeating Zol. We do this together. What do you say, Guardian? We say it's about time. Good picture. <laughs> All right. Nice, nice, nice. So, basically, we need to reforge the Valkyrie, a giant spear throwing thing that we make that you kind of seen everywhere in the trailers for this game. Well, it's going to be interesting, but um yeah, I enjoyed this game so far and uh, when it comes to Nocris and stuff, I'm not sure if we've seen the last of them or not. I really don't, because if we just killed them right then and there, then Destiny really screwed up. And that's it. I mean, really, come on. That's stupid. This guy's been, like, been hyped up since Destiny 2. And with the community hyping up, too, as well, with Aeris Morn and everybody. So, uh, yeah, we're going to end it here. Hope you enjoyed the story so far. I am. Anyway, my name is Alex Tyler. See you guys later.